In DaVinci Resolve, you have the possibility to share notes. You can select a node from a clip, mainly for color grading, and then decide that this is a shared node and share it among other clips. Let me show you how it works. I have here the first clip where I did some basic color correction, nothing magical. And then I want to create some grading, simple grading, not much. I will select the last clip here and for example, drop down the green to give it this kind of look if you like to. And I would like the other clip where already I have done some color correction to share the same look of this clip of orange. The best way to do that is to make this clip a shared clip and take it to the other clip. And to do that, you right click on the clip and you say save as shared node. Now it has a name, shared node. Let's double click and change the name for green, for example. And notice the double arrows, meaning this is a shared node. It can go among clips and it's locked. Now I'll go back to my first clip here and I want to add the same node. So I will right click on the last node here and add node. And you notice at the end, I have here green. This is the name of the shared node we have saved. I will just apply. Notice that it has appended to the graph our green node. So now we have both of them the same. Now by default, the shared node is locked, so you don't change it by mistake. But if you want to add more on the shared lock and share them with the other clips, then you will have to unlock it. So you uncheck lock node, and then you can do, for example, a different adjustment just like this. Okay, we make it more greenish. If you come back now to the clips where you had the shared node, you will notice that the same changes has been affected. But now why this is very useful? You can now continue the work here and do some other adjustment for this clip and come back to this clip and also continue your work and do some other adjustment if you like. So actually you're sharing a single node and you are not sharing the whole node structure, which is very practical. Thank you. I will see you in the next lecture.